Well, this weekend, thousands of people will be in Little Rock for our first ever marathon. Among them, bicycle riders, but they won't be there for their health or for racing, but for the runners and the walkers. Here's Liz Massey. Okay. Stan Neal and Steve Yarberry are going for a bike ride. Yeah, go ahead and put it in the bottom. But they're not packing the usual gear. Stuff that hopefully we wouldn't use. Their equipment? The mask is uh, in another pouch. Can help save lives. For instance, in a sudden cardiac arrest, we would be able to provide uh, early defibrillation. Uh, as paramedics, we have all the equipment to uh, provide advanced airways. Uh, we can gain IV access and uh, get drugs on board. Neil is the coordinator of MEM's first ever bike medic team. Well, I guess the main thing would be there's not many people doing it. So far, there are 11 members on the bike medic team. They've been training for about two months and will make their first debut this Sunday at the Little Rock Marathon. Where a traditional ambulance can't go, these guys can. You can thread your way through crowds pretty easily on a bicycle as opposed to uh, any other form transportation. Now, of course, you have to work a little bit harder. The medics will work in pairs, either two paramedics or a paramedic and EMT. They communicate by radio. Go ahead. But they won't just work special events. Such as tornadoes. Uh, it would be possible to send bike teams in to uh, clear areas, uh, first respond, uh, basically do